I've gone from next to no followers on Twitter to about 3,000, which for me is fantastic. You know, why can't I be an emerging photographer at 65? I retired in uh, 2017. To be honest with you, I wasn't really prepared for retirement. I was basically bored sitting around. And I remembered I'd had all these negatives of all the work that uh, uh, I'd shot in Glasgow, sitting in the loft somewhere. I spent hours, hours searching through old boxes and folders trying to find them. Eventually found them, um, dusted them off, literally, and looked at them and thought, right, you know, maybe there is uh, somebody would be interested in these. I started putting things on Twitter. And I put one picture on and got quite a good response. So I waited a couple of days and thought, well, is that a bit of a fluke? And I put another couple of pictures on. And again, I got a, a kind of building response here. It's amazing, actually, how it's, how it's kind of all built up. Every family had a, you know, the family camera, you know, the old box brownie type thing that maybe your grandparents have maybe still got in the loft somewhere. I, I always wanted to take the pictures, have the camera, and always felt comfortable framing things with looking through a viewfinder. I'm dyslexic, so when I'm reading, words jump around. So what I was doing, I think, even at age six or seven, I found that taking a picture was, I can tell a story. Being dyslexic as well, I wasn't a great note taker, so my notes aren't good and 40 years has gone by, my memory is not so good. So, I, you know, I would go online and um, and put this tweet out and say, I'm walking down this street, I'm taking these pictures, and people come, would come back, could be quite nice about it, say, no, you're not, Joss, that's actually Renfield Street, not Socky Hall Street. You suddenly realise that, you know, People are, are reacting to it in, in, in a more personal way. There's a woman who, who follows me. She sent me a note saying, it's brought all the memories back. Yes, you know, we didn't have a lot of money. The housing w was awful. But I used to love walking up the Mary Hill Road holding the hand of my granddad. And you brought it all back. my wife's um, annoyance sometimes. I, I take over part, the bathroom, then you can get all the bits out of the tanks and the chemicals and play about with, with all of that. I still have the, maybe the same approach to, to photography as I, as I did in 1978. Going through that process, I kind of thought, hold on, this is a, this, this is rekindled something now. Maybe I can do something in photography, do something new now. But no, that's why I described I'm emerging at 65. Hey, you know, this is great. I feel good about it. You know, hope other people do too.